আসসালামু আলাইকুম আই এম হুমায়রা আখতারি ইউর আর্টস অ্যান্ড ক্রাফট টিচার ওয়েলকাম টু মাই অনলাইন ক্লাস হোপ ইউ অল আর ডুইং ওয়েল উই নো নাও এ ডেজ হোল ওয়ার্ল্ড এফেক্টেড বাই কোভিড নাইনটিন দ্যাট ইজ করোনা ভাইরাস নাইনটিন সো স্টে সেফ স্টে অ্যাট হোম টুডে আই উইল টেক ইউর ক্লাস ক্লাস সিক্স There are two chapters in your midterm exam. Chapter number 3 and chapter number 4. Chapter number 3 is Folk Arts and Crafts of Bangladesh. Chapter number 4 is Common Rules of Drawing Tools and Media of Drawing Pictures. Today I am talk about chapter number 3 Folk Arts and Crafts of Bangladesh. Please bring your books in front of this video. and go to page number 16 chapter number 3 folk arts and craft of bangladesh this chapter we will be able to explain what is folk art of folk art and give examples examples explain what is craft and give examples describe the folk arts of bangladesh describe the crafts of bangladesh so lesson number 1 concept about folk art page number 17 we know about the painting of the primitive people but it is not a fact that all the primitive people who lived in the cave could draw pictures but some of them draw pictures drew pictures very well they were made draw pictures later on they learned to make pots and statues which were made in a simple way such as same of such as same of the primitive people could draw fine pictures and make statues so from primitive people to nowadays people draw pictures and make pots statues this is the simple way the folk artists did the same since a saint period in village and town some people could draw fine pictures and make dolls they were they draw pictures and made dolls in a simple way their children learned it the children of their families sat near to their fathers and uncles and learned how to draw pictures and make dolls in this way folk arts have been made of made for thousands of years in the same method this art gives delight in the mind of common people so it is said folk art is a creation of common people and for common people so basically the point is the normal the common people or the simple people who lives in maybe village or maybe small town or maybe in town they make those dolls or they draw pictures or they uh, can make folk art which have been made for thousands of years in the same method the art gives delight in the mind of common people so that folk art is a creation of common people and for common people so it is between common people to common people of common people and the for common people the element of folk arts are common to all over the world as you know that element mean the things which anything is made things with which anything is made for example some similar folk arts are made in all countries with soil wood cloth cotton metal objects leaf bamboo cane etc those are dresses those are furnitures could be they are could be folk ornaments folk musical instrument needle work dolls etc it could be anything in this page or in this uh, page number 17 there are two single drums one drum from brazil and one drum from bangladesh bangladesh represent this drum called shokher hari and the brazilian drum with different kind of design 
those those two potteries are different kind of design with different shape but look at this they are like kind of similar they are drum and they are uh, pottery you can call them pottery also brazilian people draw this drum with their own cultural drawing and we made it with their own culture so activity number one and activity number two activity number one you can follow the folk arts is the creation of common people and for common people so you will have to explain this to yourself folk art is the creation of common people and for the common people okay activity number two find out the similarities and dissimilarities of folk art and folk art with primitive art so you have to find out similarities or dissimilarities of folk art with primitive art now please turn number turn page number 18 lesson number two and three introduction to folk arts of bangladesh in our bangladesh fairs are held in village and market on their different occasion different occasions such as the bengali new year it could be it could be post shankranti beside fair are arranged locally on the occasion of Eid, Puja, Mahram, Rath Jatra, etc. In those fairs, with other things, different dolls are dolls of attractive and bright colors. Those uh, common people who made those beautiful things, beautiful clay, beautiful clay things or wood things, those are could be toy, those are could be dolls, those are could be uh, elephant horse wood then those clay and wood made toys and dolls are being colored so common people are made dolls elephant horse and many kind of uh, many kind of things attractive things of course then they colored it with beautiful and colorful color like red blue yellow orange green black etc in this space there are different kind of dolls made with clay have a look on them there are some elephant with a person some horses different kind of colorful horses also it seems like color it colored colorful it uh, sometimes it black it looks black Okay, elephant and horses are placed on wooden decks. Then four wheels are joined at the downwards so that those can be used as toy. Okay, beside different kinds of shikha floor mats, table mats, etc. are made of jude. With this clay work, beside different kind of shikha floor mat, table mat, etc. also, included in this exhibition or in this fair you could say then they are colored in laser time the village woman of bangal make a kind of katha with beautiful design and different pictures by sewing with coloring cotton very carefully so it's called nokshi katha we are all know about this nokshi katha right there are stories of well and o of their leaves remain in this katha toys and nokshi katha are the remarkable folk arts of bangladesh beside those the shakir haris the fancy earthen wares wooden seat paintings wall pictures nokshi fan design fans nokshi cake block pictures of burnt clay so in laser time the in bengali women bengali women in village women of course they were used to made all those things this shakir hari wall picture wooden seat painting then uh, then uh, nokshi fan nokshi cake block pictures of burnt clay 
all those known as four cars of Bangladesh. So now we are talking about the Alpona. It is an old costume of Bangladesh to draw Alpona in different work, function, puja, uh, wedding ceremony, Gai Holoth in front of Oed Yard Road of the Shroid Minar on the 21st February. We all know about this Alpona thing. It basically made of motif, lots of motif together, then make it a Alpona. To all those folk arts, the same pictures is used again to the design, the picture which is used again and again called motif. The these motifs of the folk art of Bangladesh are the lotus ornaments design the moon the sun elephant bird battle leaves etc it could be anything kind of this this art has been mixed with our life for thousands of years our folk art bears the testimony of the culture of our own nation even outside the country so we now we get the folk arts are made of ordinary materials like clay old cloths, wooden bamboo cans, sponge, wood, plum leaves or date leaves. Those folk arts made with very ordinary color, blue color, red color, charcoal, etc. In this space, we have to see two pictures with first one is Kalka and the second one is Pater Shika. Kalka is one kind of motif which is can use in Alpona and which is also can represent by his own so there is also a picture of Alpona very beautiful Alpona ba black background and the white color and the other picture is Pater Shikha Pater Shikha is made of the jute things and Basically, Ejinishtake and a chadder thick nis theke, Jula no hoi, Ebong Epitore, Kunokta Hari, Bakunata Kolshi type Kunukichuke Raktaparo, Juli Raktaparo. So, in this chapter, in this uh, lesson, we can get activity one. Let us see which group can write the name of the highest number of four cards. Okay, and the activity two draw a design using any two motifs okay student now this is the time I will give you a homework lesson 2 3 activity number 2 draw a design using any two motifs and I can suggest two motif means it can be kolka it could be a lotus so with lotus and with kalka make a beautiful alpona design and in this lesson we get some new word learn custom of art nokshikatha element and motif so students that's it for today chapter number three we learned today lesson number one and lesson number two and three. So next class, we will get lesson number four, lesson number five and six. So stay safe, stay blessed and take care of yourself. Assalamu alaikum.